As a teacher, you're always looking for programs to, to teach kids. Schools are given the opportunity to bring um, a team of three Merino Weathers uh, to the Adelaide show to be judged. And they get classes on their wool quality and their meat quality, and also how they look in a pen of three. Well, it's a great opportunity for us to showcase the Merino sheep breed, and uh, we're really quite excited about it because it's an opportunity for kids to get a bit of exposure into industry. Our kids that we have at the school are high school age students, ranging from eight, year eight through to year 12, and we actually use this as a teaching tool across all of those year levels. The school kids not only hand on experience with the sheep, but they also learn about the other sides of the industry as well, like parasites, the shearing, the handling, the care and attention, the nutrition that you've got to have to make sure that you've got an excellent product at the end of the day. And of course, then you uh, come to the Adelaide show and you get the results uh, of your hard work and effort that you have had through, the, through that six month period. This program um, is about getting kids uh, connected to the wool and quality. And, and so, you know, they can, from a metre, they can look at a sheep and go, wow, that's probably a good sheep, and then they go over and look for finer details. We never got that as, as young people, and I just reckon this course is fantastic for them. Yeah, I've learned a lot about animal husbandry from the day we got them. I've been feeding them every day, looking after them, just monitoring what's going on with them. I'm more likely to get into merinos now because of this competition. I learnt there's more than just wool comes off merinos. You get the wool, you get the meat. Yeah, all the people that do the weighing and judging and all that, they're all people that, that know what they're on about um, and have been in the industry for a long time, so it's good to get to know them. I've been very pleased with the, with the quality of the wool. It's whiteness, it's brightness, uh, the style and character of the wools are, are quite exemplary. Well, it's really good because you get to form a relationship with the animals and you get to learn more about them specifically, um, whereas in your classroom with 20 or so other kids, you don't get as much interaction with them. Before we actually got them, there was a lot of preparing for the weathers as well, so we didn't actually spend much time in the classroom, it was all outside, hands-on stuff. I'd really love to do this after school as well, um, but there's other things I'd love to do as well, so it's in one of my top five. <laughs> We're making links with industry. Um, the kids are coming down here and they're talking to other, other stud merino sheep people here uh, and they're just starting to make those connections and so through their involvement here in this particular competition we're starting to see a real growth in that understanding of, of how the stud merino sheep uh, operates. Um, I've been learning about um, dressing them up to show them and also about the genetics and the management of them to make sure your animals are as, well, as good as they can be. From an education perspective, we can get quite a few different things out of it apart from the actual show day, uh, where we get the animals down here and compete against other schools who've all been in the same sort of boat, thinking these same issues through, and uh, it's, it's a really great day to just come together and just see what we've done over the course of the year. I think, I think she's, a, she's a life change and experience, coming all the way to the city just to show our sheep. I think it's quite good because we don't get to come to the city much. So if we can come here and do sheep, we'll yeah. get It's just a great experience yeah. overall. Like just, just being, coming down and working with other people, learning stuff. Encourage your teachers to get involved as well. I think it's fantastic to, that, that all states should be involved it, uh, to encourage wool growers all across Australia. Our industry needs all the, all the support and all the, all the fresh blood that it possibly can to improve in the future.